wow. Happy Monday, everybody. Good morning. Good morning, asking Becca. Becca is correct. This is the Payne's Creek Killing dev game. So you have no idea the notes and journals that we will be collecting. I don't even think I can comprehend it. How could you... How dare you not look forward to playing the chicken cop game? How could you? Eric, good morning. You can't- No, you got- What about the chickens and the horse? I can't believe you guys won't let me be a disgusting furry on stream. Shut up, Lo-Fi. I can't believe you. After all this time, you won't support me in my moment of need. <laughs> Oh, that's not fitting the screen. Thank you. Carlos, welcome. No, we're not. Okay, I found. I found a chicken mystery game. This isn't the chicken mystery game, okay? Everybody relax. Carlos, it's fine. We're just- today- okay, today we're solving crimes in reverse. We're looking at scenes, and then we're figuring out what happened in the scene to be investigated. And when I played the demo for this game, I did a bad job. <laughs> just, so... We're will gramming it. Sound check, also. While the sound is on. I feel like this game doesn't have an ongoing soundtrack that plays while you investigate, but then again, what do I know? What do I see? I see a scene to investigate. So everybody consider that. Oh. Hey, that's a bad sound. That someone should have considered not doing. Perhaps. I don't... Okay, get me out. Get me out of that. Disclaimer, this is a work of fiction. Okay? It doesn't replicate real crime scenes. Okay? So everybody calm down. Hello, please. I am your personal assistant for this exam. Hello? Okay. I are we are we Will Graham? <laughs> are we gonna be Will Graham or are we gonna be it sound that's exactly that warning sounded like something we could be not Will Graham. So like Bill Bill Dram? G Gil Gil Ram Gil wait There he is Billiam Draham Bill Ham Bill Crack There's a lot going on There's a lot going on I do like I do like Bill Ham I think that's like a fun name for a detective. And also Bill doesn't look like a word anymore. So Yeah. Creating your data file. Why is this happening? Recording complete. Welcome to the crime scene reconstruction room. Okay. Prior to the exam, here are some important notes to go through. Why are you speaking from like six rooms over? Observe each scene correctly. 
I'll try. Okay. When there aren't enough as it evidence? It's fine. Okay, we're gonna be ending the stream halfway through. I think the low audio narrator is part of the game. She's. It's like she's talking in the gymnasium, but I'm not in the gymnasium. I'm outside of the gymnasium. If this is the demo again, just to mock me. Oh, am I blocking the subtitles? Okay. Uh, no, I didn't mean to hit enter. I wanted to alt tab. Okay. That was a problem for me. I can move myself over to the other side. I don't know. Who was the gateway driver and who stole the purse and synopsis? Okay, the police have arrested a man, they suspect. I need more subtitles so I can look at it. Go to rob a bank. They confiscated items found in the van the man was standing by. The police were able to get the man to give up the names of his accomplices. It's suspected that the man and his accomplices might also be involved in the purse snatching of Helen Turner. However, all the police have are the items from the getaway van, the criminal records of the three men that were going to rob the bank, and the incident report from Helen Turner. Okay. Thank, thank you. Get me out. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, mouse sensitivity. Oh, mouse sensitivity. That's something that I'm thinking about. Um, can we... It's already at 10? Can we... Brave Bushido... Welcome to the crime solving simulator. It's much better for me. All right, okay. I don't like this liminal space that we're in, actually. Okay. Okay, description, newspaper, quote unquote master plan, quote unquote split, chain of custody received from Mason Widmark by Casey Maverick. Receipt. You're streaming your- oh fuck yeah. I don't know what any of this information means yet, so that's something to consider. Um, can I look through the full- no. Okay. Oh, interesting. Okay. I can zoom. Wait. Secret codes. Interesting. Someone was drinking Four Pine Premium Brewed Beer. Okay. So, that's probably relevant to the crime. Menthol stick. Smooth and encouraging. Oh, to be encouraged. Okay. Oh. Okay, from 38348. Three, okay. Are you sure we can trust this guy? He seems all over the place. I know you hate unpredictability, but we've already seen what he can do. I'm sure it'll be fine. Lorenzo vouched for him personally. So these are not Lorenzo. 
I hate Lorenzo as well, <laughs> but someone that has his respect must be at least somewhat capable. I overheard something real interesting. 600 bucks cash. It'll be real quick and it's on the way. Boss told us don't use this number if it's not related to the job. You're too loyal to that guy. Isn't he younger than you? We go a long way back. Besides, there's rumors that he was already stealing big time at just eight years old. In that sense, he's my senior. Whatever, you win or not, we can split 50-50. Well, send me the details on my other phone. You idiot. <gasps> 10 -509, baby. I mean, that's also- this was 10 -509. Okay, this was 10 -509. This was sent at 10.30 p.m. And this was only sent at 2.20 p.m. Oh, no. Turner Helen, can I... Can I read this? Am I missing the arrows? Okay, I they're under my chat and I didn't see them. Gotta go back and read the other one then. Oh God, Helen Turner, 10.05.09. Officer Helen Jones, Caucasian, female, American, 5'5". Five five. Name of the suspect, unknown, light-skinned, under 5'5". Five five. Powerful, dark hair. Items taken. A purse, a rose gold cross oh rose gold cross body, keys, phone, mint green case, wallet, rectangular, snap, chevron, white and turquoise, credit card, clover bank, Helen Turner. I mean I assume so. Lottery ticket. Oh fuck. Now she's never gonna win. Oh Carter Frank. Well it can't be him, cause he's not under 5'5". Five five. He's what was in the Solid Gate Penitentiary for petty theft, and then the Willow Bay Correctional Facility for shoplifting, and then the Darkwater Detention Center for conning money from civilians. That's actually really powerful. Carter's known for having done forgeries, but it was never proven, and he was never convicted. You're all too tall. Release for good behavior. Oh, a good boy. Identity theft. <laughs> An armed robbery. Never mind. Not a good boy. You you guys are all too tall. Petty theft. Breaking and entering. Con conned money from women. Interesting. Eye color black? Is that... Is that real? His name's Young Anthony, baby. Fuck yeah, dude. Theft. Helen Turner. Brown Brown, Los Angeles. Housewife. Same as house. I was at home for pretty much the whole morning. On... This. Okay. I went to wake up- I went to wake up call cafe to meet up with my friend around 2 p.m. Nothing of note happened. I just told my friend that the news had announced the winning numbers of a lottery I played and I'd won some money. I was going to cash it in today. We made plans to meet up again to celebrate. Oh, he knew about the money. That's why he was texting about the money. Because he was at the cafe and he heard the cafe at the cafe. I left the cafe about 45 minutes later. I headed towards cart convenience that was around the time that I got knocked over by a man coming up from behind me. Next thing I knew, I was watching him turn around the left corner with my purse in his hands. You never really think such things would happen to you until they do. All I can remember is that he was a bit taller than me, but he had dark hair and light skin. As soon as I was able to gather my wits, I asked a passerby to call the police. Understood. Okay, so we got Frank, we got Chad, and we got Anthony, baby. Alright, go back here so I can read this now. My master plan. <laughs> okay. Alright, thank God. Clover Bank, monthly swap. Lorenzo was sent all of us exact date. Part one of swap. 315, 20 minute window, every second counts. Be in position 315 sharp, get in, get out. Minimum security. Security returns from swap. Second part of swap. Too much activity. Plan B, activity returns to normal. Act like 410 ish. Plan C, wait another month? Fuck. Split 55% with the man with the plan, 15% with the helper, 25% with the getaway driver, and then 5% for, for Lorenzo. Well, 
that's kind of that. What? What about? What is Lorenzo? What? Give him more. Oh Jesus Christ Almighty! Why is this here? Wilson Richmond, the richest man in Portland. Richmond's benevolence and the donating to sources. He's been in the hospital. Wilson's dying. The murderer of Victoria Wells is arrested. Oh, here's the winning lottery numbers. Here it is. So she was making money. And someone exposed a pyramid scheme. And someone... The fact that this is all actual text that I could read... Very powerful, actually, can I just say. All right, and then what's this? Van location, initial arrest, Clover Bank, understood. Supreme Burgers. Oh, Supreme Burgers. Okay, what is the information? What is the stuff in the basket? Items from the getaway van. Okay. Is that relevant? How much money is this? One, two, three, four, five, six. Hundred. And what an odd amount of money. Okay. 600 and something dollars. Good for him. I guess. He smoked the cigarette. Okay. Who are you? You're not Lorenzo. I don't even know who Lorenzo is. He also hates Lorenzo, though. You're the 600 bucks cash guy. As if that helps me. I love how this is the tutorial, and I'm like, what the fuck? It's on the way. Oh my god, Brave Bushido, thank you for following. I'm sorry if this is agony to watch, because you've already played the game. There wasn't a secret thing behind, which is unfortunate. Okay. This is so- chain of custody. Okay, so Lorenzo was the one that texted them the date. So that so it wasn't Lorenzo. Lorenzo's not involved. You work in a museum? <laughs> well, you know, agony. Part one of Swat 20 minute went away every second counts be in position, get in and out. And then they swap? What are we swapping? Okay, so I'm assuming that she won... She only won $600 and the person in the van had more than $600. But not by much. They have 30 extra dollars. So is this- is this Lorenzo? No, it can't be Lorenzo. Is anybody in chat smart?
Well, how much money are we taking? Validate your cash. Okay. Frank, Chad, and Anthony. My favorite guys in the world. Which of you is the driver? This is the question. They split the- but how much money was it? In the bank! Smoking cigarettes, which is useful to me. Drinking beer. Women should not drink alcoholic beverages during pregnancy, okay? Is there something in the can? Can I just like... Asky, I'm glad that you're an idiot because I'm also an idiot. And that's something that we can really like think about together. You know? Why is Supreme Burgers here? Why is Supreme Burgers relevant to me and like... And like my knowledge, you know, I understand this because that's where she was and they heard it. And then the thing got robbed and then they went up to the bank. But what about Supreme Burgers? I don't know the value for the thing. Four hundred dollars, forty dollars in cash. He's thirty-five. Okay. I need to get- I need to- my brain needs to work. So keep that in mind. My brain needs to work for this- in this game. And right now, it doesn't. Who was the getaway driver, and then who was involved in stealing Helen's purse? Those are the questions that we must answer. I can sprint? Okay, good to know. Becca, thank you for the sip. Well, the getaway driver- well... I don't understand how I'm supposed to narrow down Counterfeiter escapes authorities? Mocking produce for something else good about- Okay, so is that why these bills look weird? Is that- is that why? Is this what American Fives look like? Why do they look so different than everything else? As a non-American. Are the is this real? That's how they look? Why? Why do they look like that? Why do they do that? Everything else is the same size, and then the fives are big. <laughs> okay. 
No artistic merit. Understood. Am I supposed to be looking for counterfeit bills right now? Because if I am, as a non-American, it's over. Like, I can't even begin to express to you how much it's over. Um... You only need to, you need to be cautious for higher value bills. Forgers have been found, have used $20 bills and less to circulate the fake bills. Methods check for the authenticacy of cash be found on page four. Can I have page four? Oh, this is the only thing that's relevant apparently. Is the prize amount. If I click read, it's just like, don't read anything else. Fuck it. Uh, don't worry about it. That's not something that's relevant to you. This is relevant to you. You fucking idiot. You stupid idiot. Um, okay, sorry. I was curious about American money, but that's my bad, I guess. I am so... <laughs> so, like, what do I do? I was so excited to play this game, and I'm still excited to play this game, but, like, at what cost? You know? Helen Turner at quickandfast.com. So think about that. Okay. Okay, she went to car convenience. And then... These men are all taller than her and all have dark hair and light skin. So... Are you the counterfeiter? I'm just going to assume you're the counterfeiter because it's giving me money to look at. So, which one of you did the sh did the thing? You conned money? Identity theft. Any of you good at counterfeiting money? Or is Lorenzo the one who counterfeits money? Or are you... Lorenzo's the only one that's not here. In the file. So... But then it says... Getaway driver plus 5% for Lorenzo. So I don't think... Alex, welcome. I'm Bill Ham, everyone's favorite detective who does what can only be described as a good job. Um, I, I don't. <laughs> what is Lorenzo's job? What is his job? He isn't the man with the plan. He isn't the helper. He isn't the getaway driver. He's Lorenzo. Or is he one of these, like, he's just, he's just Lorenzo. And, like, that's something that you gotta know. And this is Lorenzo, presumably. Lorenzo and him are friends. Is this the other guy? Is it, is it Lorenzo and this boy who overheard the thing? Isn't he younger than- Oh, the boss. Okay, wait. No, wait, my brain is activating. My brain's activating. The boss is younger than this guy and has been stealing since he was eight years old. So... How old are all of you? You're 35, you're 28, and you're 38. This is not eight years old, so. I think Lorenzo is the one in the Freddy Fazbear costume. That is something that I'm thinking about. 
What is this? Citizen yes? American citizen, I guess? Okay, well, there's nothing about anybody stealing since they were eight. But we do know that someone is younger than someone. So it's either... It's either Carter... Or Harris. Because, like, this... Those are the only ones that are, like... It could be you... Who's the oldest... And we're talking about someone younger than you, which is one of these two. Or... I've been looking at their criminal- because, like, they were sentenced... This one was sentenced in 92. This one was sentenced in 2000. This one was sentenced in 95. So is it you? You weren't eight years old, but, like... Carter's known for having done forgeries. Okay. Is it him, Car? So isn't he younger than you? So this is so this is the boss? And then they're talking to, to Anthony. So you weren't involved, because you're the boss, presumably, of the operation. Which means that you are the one in a text message conversation with Chad? Who's a good boy, apparently, and was released for good behavior? So I have to answer who's the, who's the getaway driver. Um... No. And then who was involved in stealing Helen Turner's purse? So... Whatever. You in or not, question mark. So is are you two are you Chad and whatever the fuck? You're Chad are you Chad and Anthony? Is the is these two having a conversation? These boys? Unless O O O means 1900. Which would be pretty crazy, cause that'd be pretty crazy. Identity theft. Who the fuck is Lorenzo? <laughs> what if I just put names in and then the game tells me I did a bad job and it's like you aren't fit to play the video game and it just ends. It just like closes and the game is over. What if I do that? I think that'd be pretty cool, actually. So if you're known for doing forgeries, and also you're the boss- Well, no, because- Man with the plan and the getaway driver are two different people. But is boss the man with the plan? Who's to say? Lorenzo sends everyone the exact date, so think about that. Lorenzo is just around. Um, you're put in a definite leave, and then the rest of the game is just you sitting around waiting for your performance review, and they bring you into the office, and they're like, bad job. You know? Okay, yeah, so the phone belongs to not Lorenzo. The phone belongs to... Not Frank, presumably. So the phone belongs to one of you two. So one of you is the getaway driver. Which one of you drives well? How do I know the difference? 
How do I tell? Unless it's this guy. Who's the young- But he wasn't doing crime before. And he's a good boy. So... Identity theft and armed robbery. Well... He does seem to have... If he's the, if this is the man with the plan, if this is the boss, where they were put in, I don't know what the fuck any of this is. You think I know where the jails are? These are a lot of prisons that they've been put in. Oh. And they were cellmates. Oh my god. Oh my god, they were cellmates! Carlos! And they were cellmates, Carlos! This- this boy... No, stop it. This boy at Solidgate Penitentiary... Met another boy at Solidgate Penitentiary. And he caught money from women and they met in jail and they're friends. They're fr they're best friends. This guy will obey for five years, will obey. They then these two were best friends. This is real, Carlos. You did it. They were cellmates. They're all best friends. And they all met in jail. <laughs> like, <laughs> what does this do for me? How does this help me solve the crime? Unclear. Now, if you can, if you can then tell me how this helps me solve the crime that they met in jail, then because it's like okay, I mean, I assume that they would. They're crime boys. Does- does the phone message go over their history? Are they like, oh, my- my best friend. Um... My best friend and guy. We go a long way back. Okay. Two of them met in jail, though. But, like, this is the oldest one. Frank and... Well, no. He was in Solidgate from 92 for five years, and then you were in Solidgate in 03, which is not at all it. That's just not it at all. Um, Willow Bay in 00, Willow Bay in 99. So you're the young boy. Who's been stealing since you were eight years old? So it's your phone. Okay, so you're the getaway driver. Frank Carter, wait. Wait, everyone shut the fuck up. Everyone shut the fuck up. It's Frank Carter. Oh, brave Bushido, I should- I should ban you for such a thing. Okay. So Frank Carter... <laughs> Fucking no! No! Okay, Frank Carter's the getaway driver. Wait, okay, I'm understanding how the video game works. It's all coming together. So, he was being texted by, not you, because... So it was Anthony. Because it's not Lorenzo. Lorenzo texted from a different number. And if this is the boss and he's just a little guy, then it's Anthony Young. 
right? What if I hit submit and I get both of them wrong? What the fuck does this say? What does this mean? Oh. Two of them. Two of them. Right? You two of them. Two of them? Two of them? Two of them! Fucking two of them, baby! Two of them. Two of them. Asky, thank you for the sit. Why am I starting the exam? What is that help? How does But what does that have to do with anything? It's what was this to do with anything? Why am I doing an exam? What oh Oh, this is the scenes. These are the scenes that I've heard so much about that we get to investigate. The preliminary trial took me 45 minutes. Here we go, big there's multiple scenarios per scene. We're gonna be here for seven hours, baby. I'm riding the high, but I wouldn't have known if it weren't for Carlos and they were cellmates. So thank you so much. That's it. I'm just in the house. Oh, 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 we're loading. Come on. You don't need to be framey. We're okay. Okay, but what is happening? No. Can I get... Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, this is no good, actually. All right, I'm going over here. Dinosaurs! Everyone get out your fucking notebook. This is the point, this is the- it's notebook time, baby. Game, please relax with all the, like, the framey weird- it's okay. It's okay. Oh. Oh, wallet. Okay, we have Thomas. <laughs> gonna wait, where's a where's a piece of paper? I do need a piece of paper. Are you kidding me? This is fucking stupid. This is stupid. Timmy, I'm solving crime, but at what cost? Like to me and my mental health. I Alright, we got we got you, Thomas, my boy. Thomas Morris Harrington, do da, do da. Thomas Morris Harrington, da, 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 da. Okay, but is that- how do I know where you were? It's- it asked for, like, an apartment number and, like, the state that they were in. Not, like- wait, go back. Because it- it didn't ask where they live. It says where was everyone. Oh, God! So where he lives might not even be relevant to the situation, okay? Oh. I'm got girl in there. Think about that. $80 paid fuel, good for fuel only. For September. 
Du -du 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 -du. Hillside Bank. Thomas Harrington. Okay. He can drive in California. Cash out voucher on September 6th, 1998 in Las Vegas. That's not the time that I need, though. So. Jimmy. Jimmy L. The cash. He, he photo prints. Multiple photo prints on the 7th at 822, available for pickup. Okay, I'll come back to you. This is going to overwhelm me with a speed that you cannot even imagine. But then who was phone? Hey, honey, uh, I just wanted to remind you to pick up the kids tomorrow because I won't be able to. <sighs> Anyways, miss you. Safe driving. <laughs> 30 photo prints of his wife? It could have been for the the kids. School day. I think this Timmy, this game does take place back in the back in the day because the phones are old. So or at least this scenario takes place back in the day, because the phones are old. Tell me what's happening to you. We need to talk. Call me tonight. What's happening to you? ATM transaction. At what time? 918 at 12. Withdrawed 300. <laughs> Withdrawed $300 from the checking in Bakersfield, California. Okay. Where do you live? Do you live in California? You do. But you live in Los Angeles, California. So that's weird. I think. I don't actually know where those two places are in relation to each other. Someone was eating corn sticks. And... Ooh, the fair... These are so... I love environments like this. I just want to look at everything. What's this? Someone was eating ketchup. Cup of tea. Very cute. Let me open the cupboards. In the demo, I could open cupboards. Very cute little lion magnet on the thing. Yeah. Oh, Jesus Christ. If Nicholas is... Why is it rotating? I don't... Okay. If Nicholas is too fussy, you can give him some crackers in the cabinet. For emergencies, call me at these numbers for the diner or these numbers for the Wilsons. I will buy groceries with the next paycheck. No cooking without mommy or Thomas present. Ducky. Very powerful. Oh, Nicholas drew a thing. Very powerful, brave machine. That's the thing. The only thing that matters is the tea. But it's like iced tea? Or something? It's like Lipton. Okay, they were eating the subs. Everybody shut up. They were eating the subs. Okay, so Nicholas is a child. That's something to understand, I guess. Is that Nicholas? That's a child. Oh, Nicholas, no! Nicholas, you can't do a sword on the ground. Nicholas, what is this? I'm crouching. Big shoe. Nicholas shoe? Hazel. Okay, we got two children in the home. They each have one pair of shoes that are labeled so that they don't forget. Wait, I can go prone? Just like the creature! Oh my god, we're the creature! Okay, what... What was the date when last we heard? September 18th, which was a Friday.
Okay, and then we've got Gina, I'm sorry, but I don't think I can pay you this Friday on the 11th. I will pay the amount next Friday along with your next payment. Hey, Catherine, I talked to the Wilsons and they are happy to have you. The work starts from 1 p.m. to 9 p.m., but since it pays well, it can help with your family situation. Anyway, call me if you're interested. I left the grocery con agreement con I left the agreement contact inside. Why did I read the word grocery? We'll never know. I think it's better if you break things off with Thomas. Why did she just leave this on the counter? He probably saw it. Like, that's, she was like, what's up with you? Tell me what's wrong. This is what's wrong. <laughs> I'm assuming Thomas has, like, a debilitating gambling addiction. And also, Thomas, wait. And also, Thomas isn't their dad because it says mommy or Thomas. So, Thomas is not biological father, I think. Um, expect on the job. Making dinner, cleaning the house, doing the laundry, assisting them when they want to move around the house. Okay, so she works for, like, an old family. Take their medication, use the restroom, take a bath, change into their nightwear, get into bed for sleeping, locking up at night. Any other times, you must be on standby for any needs they might have. Okay? Call log. Oh, fuck. Lots of calls from the, from and to this number. And then this one. You know when your head hurty? Wait. Hi, Mrs. Patton. This is Mrs. Bird, Nicholas's teacher. Nicholas wasn't able to take part in today's activities today. Make in today's sure activities today. Backpack next time. Okay. That's it. Now I will be taking things into my own hands. Who? Was that the devil? <laughs> I'm, so, so, I'm sorry. Okay. Three four eight one one three. Oh, they get calls a lot. Oh, they get calls a lot. I think that someone has a terrifying gambling addiction. And... Start on our all-day breakfast menu, rated for top five family diner in the hills. Think about that. Three, four, eight, six, two, four. Has anyone called that for breakfast? They didn't, but it's the best in the hills, baby. The fuck is wrong with you? Oh God! <laughs> what if, what if instead I just closed the video game? You know, what if instead of this, I just closed the video game? Okay, kids start school. Thomas takes care of kids until Gina comes over, and then Gina takes over from three p.m. to eight p.m. Who's Gina? Kids start school. Will Wilson's one p.m. to nine p.m. Okay, so the mom works two jobs. She's working, like, a fucking insane amount of jobs. Um, like, it's crazy. Grocery shopping in blue. Star Diner Wilson's. Thomas leaves to Albuquerque on the 7th of, of September. I saw August and I got confused. Wilson Stardiner. Wilson Stardiner. Wilson St Oh, she's working, like, every single day. She's working two jobs. Fucking, like, no breaks in between. Every single day. Okay, this is ominous. This just blank. This and then just Gina's last day. Okay. Thomas... Comes back. Not takes care. He comes back. Pay Gina. Thomas takes care of kids. Day off. Play with kids. Thomas comes back. Don't pay Gina. Miss Olsen keeps calling. Call her back. Grocery shopping. Pay Gina. Gina has a family gathering from noon. And then just like the longest stretch of time. Gina's last day extremely horrifically ominous like i cannot stress this enough
Okay, someone has a hat, so they keep that in mind. Why was that pick up a bowl? What about this image is relevant? I don't like that. Okay. I'm crouching on the ground. The light refracting. Fuck yeah, Nintendo 64! Peace Club. What games are they playing? There's not- there's no games in there. There's no cartridge. I think Miss Olsen is one of the numbers on the phone. We got the- because we got the Olsons, we got the- I don't know who the devil was, though. Oh no, child. Oh. A recent incident has come to our attention about the lack of supervision regarding a couple students in one of our elementary schools. The, di the district CPS supervisor has already met with both students to understand the situation, and we want to take appropriate measures to ensure the safety of our students. At request of the district CPS supervisor, we will require all students, elementary or under, to be dropped off and picked up by parent guardians at bus locations. This will go into effect next Monday. Please be at your child's bus location by the times listed below. This is really 20 minutes after drop-off time. For any questions regarding the matter, please contact the district office. 892. In front of Bloomweed Park is highlighted for some reason. Unclear. Oh, is this just this is theirs? At 7.40 a.m. And then they were playing Sudoku, Sudoku, but like, but like, in, but like real, with tiles. William Shakespeare. Connor Moore in public hospital medical bill. X-ray scan. Overnight stay. Practitioner named Teresa, patient name Hazel Woods. Is Hazel the child? I'm running. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Ten thousand, nine thousand dollars just to stay overnight. The X-ray scan and the IV hydrate it wasn't even matter. It didn't even matter. It was like you sleep in hospital, you fucking idiot, you stupid idiot. Okay. What was the date on that? God, Becca, I'm like speed running. It was. No, September 6th to September 7th. Was that... Gina takes over from 3pm to 8pm. But Thomas takes care of the kids until Gina comes over. What was the time that they came in? We're unsure. We just have a date. Which isn't written... Like, Thomas left for Albuquerque on the 7th, though. Okay, I'm just, like, gathering information, and then I'm gonna go back and go over all the information. This is cute! I mean, it's pretty depressing, because I don't think good things happen. Okay, Hazel's backpack is gone. I love how Nicholas is just the dinosaur kid. I want this bag. Are you kidding me? I want this couch. I want this this bedspread. This is unbelievable. Dinosaurs, pterodactyl, parasaurophilus, velociraptor. Fuck yeah, dude. Very good. Very powerful. Hazel, mommy will be very busy and won't be able to cook for you and Nicholas. Whenever Thomas is home, he'll prepare all the meals. Otherwise, on the days that he's not home, I'll leave $12 on the dining table in the morning. Give yourself $6 and your brother the other $6. You must use this for food and only food. Oh. Oh, Hazel's diary. 
Today, Carla and Jasmine showed me their Princess Eliana dolls. During recess, I couldn't play with them because I only had the Dearly doll. I want to play with them. Then on the walk, back, on the way back, Gina let us go to a toy shop. I like my, my Dearly doll, but Princess Lena was really pretty. She was keeping the money to buy the doll. Today was PE and we played soccer. Jasmine and I were Team Red. I think Carla wanted to be Team Red too. Jasmine's really good at soccer. Walking back made me so tired and also we're running out of bread. This is not good. Today my teacher had me meet someone during lunch. Her name was Hannah. We talked about Mommy. I think she's Mommy's friend. I'm glad Mommy has someone who cares about her. It was finally Mommy's day off today, but I couldn't show him my drawings. When she wasn't sleeping, she was talking to Thomas on the phone. She seemed mad at me. Mommy's always working now, so I only see her on her day off. Last night I woke up because I heard something. Mommy was crying. She was saying that she was sorry. Thomas was hugging her. Why does Mommy need to be sorry? Today we only had oatmeal for breakfast. I miss when we walked to the store to buy muffins. Nicholas would give me half of his and I would give him half of mine, so we eat two flavors. Okay. What happened to this family that made them suddenly have no money? What is the vibe? Oh, she got the doll. Where is the doll? Why is the box empty? Where's the doll? What is this? It's a train. You spend all that money on a doll and like, where the fuck is- I mean, I guess she has it with her. Okay, this is going to be a nightmare to look at. Let me Mother's Day from Hazel. Oh, God. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day, honey. I'm sorry that it's become like this. I couldn't turn down the job. When I come back, I want to make it up to you. In the meantime, I ordered some flowers for you. Hope you like them. Wishing you a very happy birthday. Happy birthday, honey. Hope you have a wonderful day. Love you, Thomas. Merry Christmas, honey. I wish for all your wishes to come true for the new year. I've been busy because of work this past year, so I want to spend more time with you in the upcoming year. Maybe after dinner or when the kids sleep, you can show me the stars and constellations. I think I remember a few of them since you taught me last time. In 97. Okay, so this was 97. This was 98. Nope, nope, go back. Don't. This was also 98. Um... Happy Valentine's Day. You bring so much happiness into my life. Every day with you becomes so much more vibrant. I love you, honey. In 97. Happy birthday, Catherine. You're really sweet. Glad to have met you. P.S. Would you like to have coffee with me sometime? Okay, so this is before they started dating. Which was in 96. Happy birthday, honey. I'm so grateful to have you in my life. I'm starting to overcome my addiction because of you. Oh, no. I never give up on me, and I'm so thankful for that. I haven't been able to help for some time. Let me bear some of your responsibilities. It may take some time, but I want you to live the life that you always wanted. He's being nice. Like, he's just, he's trying his best, dude. He's trying to... Art class, drawing and painting for kids six, for ages six to 12. $35 per session. Okay. 864, did we call that number? No, we didn't. Irrelevant. The police department. On September 6, 1998, I was dispatched to Jerry's to an Emma Walk that came in at 1.58 p.m. I was soon met with Jeffrey Matthew, who stated that he'd finished shopping and was on the way to his car when a boy, Nicholas Woods, ran up to him. The boy asked Jeffrey to help his sister. That was when Jeffrey saw Hazel Woods unconscious on the ground of the parking lot and called 911. An employee at Terry's Toy Box witnessed Hazel walk out of the store with her brother Nicholas a few minutes prior to the call. Hazel was taken to the nearest hospital immediately. 
Okay. So it's like not good. Nicholas was worse today. Tantrums are as always, but he started throwing toys again. You need to take you need to talk to him. He needs more discipline. He doesn't. Oh, I have a family and bills too. To treat someone who helped raise your children this way, I see that you've lost your integrity. Oh boy. Stop by the gas station. Get new fuel cards for September. $80 each for two cards. Withdraw money from bank. Oh, no. Congratulations on your engagement. Congratulations on the engagement, Catherine. I'm thrilled for you. In all honesty, I was quite doubtful that it was going to work out. After all, you guys have only been dating for a year. I assumed you would go back to Miami a few months after m moving here. I'm so excited for $19.99 now. I'll definitely be there at your wedding. I don't think so. I don't think so. Yay. Money? In envelope? September food budget. Thomas's food groceries. Kids food when Thomas isn't home. My food when I don't have time to pack meals. Okay. Pay Catherine. 700 for child support from Josh. Josh's papa. Cash on next day off. 480 from Rick Wilson. And Elizabeth Wilson. Okay, that's your paycheck for the for the the Wilsons. They paid you money. She likes the stars. Is this going to be relevant? Did she take? Did she run away and take the kids to space? I don't want a custody battle. For every instance you record, include the time and day and a brief description of the situation and what the child children were doing and what you were doing. Oh, okay, no, but, but doesn't want me to read all of it. Okay. Custody battle. Understood. I'll read the dates when I go over everything. Right now, I'm having a panic attack. World building. Anything in the garbage? Fuck yeah, dude! ATM transaction record. On the 6th of September. $500. But who? In in Vegas? Oh no, in Vegas. Also, wait, you said pill bottle and I missed it. Take one tablet by mouth once per day. Search for- oh, okay. That's what I take. Wow! Okay, so she's not doing well, but that's okay. It'll help. You know? Cardholder name, Thomas Harrington. A cardholder address, card number, account number, payment due dates. New balance, $7,898. Minimum payment, the, the previous balance for the payments purchases. If we do not receive your minimum payment by the listed date above, you may have to pay a late fee of up to $39. If you make only the minimum payment each pay period, you'll pay more interest and it will take longer to pay off your balance. But the minimum payment... 157... Oh no, dude. Like... Oh no. Who took this? Who took a thousand dollars out of the bank account? Oh no. Five day trip. Summit Ironworks Industrial Co. Ring at Batgate for assistance. Park at lot 
labeled unloading representative will you shortly unload if no one's present go to front desk at the railing and the mining and the i beg your pardon six oh no he was printing he wasn't printing pictures of his wife he was printing the desert for some reason I think that Thomas was out gambling when he was supposed to be taking care of the kids. I don't weigh anything. That's pretty crazy. I think that Thomas... Was there a gun? Oh... Just like Dad! Oh, it's a BB gun. Just like Dad! <laughs> okay. Quick and simple spaghetti. Breakfast, scrambled eggs and sausage. Lunk, there's mac and cheese box. I said lunk for some reason? Use a recipe. Serve while warm. Okay. We have breakfast for 9-5. Understood. Thomas Harrington. Health insurance. Health insurance? He's a refrigerated freight driver. And he has three dependents. And... Let's make a convoy. I hate you. Think about that, though. Think about that I hate you. So... Garbage. Required payments until payday. Gas bill by 912, 6657. Thomas Carlone, $300. Low line car service. Water bill. Cell phone service. Gina, 75. How do I pay her? Borrow money. Ask for her to wait. Pay from savings. Gina's the babysitter? And then this was his list of, like, work stops. Oh, there's multiple! All these pieces of paper are different. Because I clicked on a different one before. Didn't I? It didn't look like this before. It, di it didn't look like this before. It was, like, sideways. Yeah, it's different. Call Gary. Where's the... Oh, there it is. Call Gary like Calgary. Okay, so this is his... Where he could be in the order list and the dates and if he was there or not. Okay. I'm gonna go to the bathroom really quickly. And then when I return... I'm going to have an anxiety attack over all of this. So, oh, elementary school, dress code. We'll read that after. All right, everybody. Um, while I'm gone, think. And I'll be right back. <laughs>
I'm sorry, the VTuber was what? Was it speaking in tongues? Look out. Okay. I'll say it. I don't like that. I'll be the one to say it. All right, everybody. Deep breath. We go in order. Okay. Where was Catherine at 2 p.m. on the 6th of September? Probably at the Wilsons. If this is to be believed as something that's real. What is the Wilsons' address? Oh, I had their... Nope, not you, Josh. Wait, why is this in here? Cash on next day off. Okay. 4572 Charter Street. In Santa Clarita. In. No, shut up! California. Okay, where was Tomas? On the 2 p.m. on the 6th of September. We do have his bank card. Wait, where's the Vegas transaction authorization terminal sequence from checking fee terminal fee card number dot 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 one two two three dot 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 I'm running at amazing speed. Sure is. Sure is. Thomas. Tomas. Okay, now that I have understanding of Thomas as a character, cash out voucher at a casino. Zero dollars and 37 cents. So he didn't win. Think about that. Um, he didn't win. What is the date here? The 18th of September. He withdrew $300. Okay. Gambling is going. Gambling is going. So we can all think about that. Um, all right. What's your vibe? I have to keep checking. The 6th of September. Not this one. Or this one. He cashed out. Oh, this was this. Okay, yeah. He disappeared. He went to Vegas on the 6th. Okay. At 15.09, so like three something. What was the other ticket? Was that the... The sprinting mechanic is fucking insane. No, not this one. This was at 1.30. 
Okay, I mean, he was at the, he was at the casino at two. So, we know this as a fact about him. 4830, is that the same as the... Why would I need to sprint? Because I have a lot to do. I gotta go fast, so... 4830, okay, yeah. 4830 Sunrise Road. Las Vegas, Nevada. So... Okay, where was Hazel? Okay. When was Hazel at the hospital? The 6th. Okay, and then when was the police report? Da -da -da, 205. So at 2 5, she wasn't at the hospital yet. She was at 2839 Garner's Ferry Road. In the parking lot. You know. Los Angeles. And Nicholas was also there. No. So th so this was at t wait this was at two o five. But they were at Terry's toy box. So, is that where they were technically at two? On the sixth of September. Is this game like fucking with me that badly? Is there a Terry's? I guess that would be the dispatch location, so it's fine. Okay, so that's where they are. Um, who picked up the kids on September 18th and would the insurance cover the hospital bill? Okay, let's look at the hospital bill again. X-ray scan, overnight stay, hydration treatment, checkup, and it was $10,000. Let's see if that... Running... The thing is, health insurance was for... The guy. The health insurance was for the guy... From September 30th... Okay, it covers the family. It's fine. Dependents... The policy will cover the insured when they, where they may be, should be they in either the United States of America or the Dominion of Canada. Should insured individuals seek medical assistance out of covered countries, the expenses will not, okay, great. Only a person who satisfies the below mentioned eligibility criteria or is a dependent of the insured can be covered under this policy. Cover up of the benefits limit, all general practitioner appointments, non-surgical procedures, maternity expensive, chronic condition treatments, additional coverage shall be listed under section C below. Receive bills must be from a property, credit general practitioner office, or any state. They must be legally recognized to receive the full policy coverage. Dependents that are not married to or legal family can only receive general practitioner coverage and shall not receive full benefits. So no. Because he's not their dad. Because the wedding wasn't until like next year. So they're not actually family so no and then who picked up the kids on september 18th gina has a family gathering so from noon so presumably it wasn't gina what was the and then they had to pick them up on the at 120 
So she was working. It had to be... Was it Thomas? Where was Thomas on the 18th? Thomas came back. But at what cost? Also, what was this? What is this? That's it. Now I will be taking things into my own hands. Oh, this was on the 18th. Did someone kidnap the children? Who is this? School pickup time is at like 120 1, p.m. Bus picks up at 7.40 and then drops them off at 1.20. Bus is really 20 minutes after drop-off time. So someone has to come pick the kids up. What am I zooming? Oh, district office. When was the kid- when did she write in her diary that someone came to talk to her? The 8th. There was a paper with another name. What- what name? What paper? What are you thinking of? What are you thinking about? What are you considering? The bus pickup. Oh, the names on the bus pickup. Yeah, for the- oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. Okay, Ian, Ryan, Velma, can I do 1560? Was that ever called? The district attorney? Who, who's, who, who left this voicemail? 113-9753. Um... Does the dad have a phone number? Gosh, you have a phone? Joshua? Because the thing about that voicemail is it sounds ominous derogatory. It don't sound like a friend that came to get the kids. It sounded like a threat. Hmm. Wait, what was... What was, uh, Catherine's... Wait. 139753. She had two numbers, and she was like, call me from my phone. Call me from my... No, that's not the Wilsons. 624. The CPS lady's pissed. Who is the CPS lady? What can I- what am I- I have to 
type an answer. Okay, I need to type the full name of the person who did this. Um... Where is CPS lady? If I were a CPS lady... What is, what is Mrs. Olson's name? Mrs. Wilson. Hannah, Hannah Olson? Mrs. Olson? Olsen? Where's Olson? Where's it written? I'm very... Post it. Post it in the thing in the... Okay. Don't know about calling her back. Okay, 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 okay. I've lost the plot. I ran around so much that I've completely, <laughs> I completely lost the plot. I've completely lost the plot. Oh, wait, then what were these on his phone, too? Pick up the kids tomorrow because I won't be able to. Yeah, okay, and then he didn't. Why did he get these printed? What the fuck? Why? Why did you do this? You fucking weirdo. Okay, um... Hey, what if I request someone else to pick up my child in my place? Contact the main office. Is it Han- is it Hannah? I don't know how to spell- I don't know- Call log. Okay, wait, who- okay. 113 was calling a lot. Like, a lot. And not getting an answer. Like, a ton. And then finally it was like, goodbye. But then who was phone? Anna, please, I need your name, please. Please do this for me. Please do this for me. Hannah, please. I've truly lost the plot to, like, such an extent. I don't know Hannah's last name. I don't know where to find Hannah's last name. I don't know... Note in the drawer. Just says cash on the on next day off. And then they got cash. And then there was Megan? 
who also exists. And then... Now I've just, like, I was running around so fast that I've, like, I've fucked it. Okay. Let's start from zero. We've got... No, in the, there are two notes in the garbage. So there's this one. About paying Gina and being unable to pay Gina. Um, and then art school for kids who do art. And then the police. And then... This is his desk, so I don't think... There's the thing, there's his work schedule. Is that anywhere in here? For any reason? This is just to confuse you, I think. Because it's like, where did he go? Like, he was in Vegas. He was doing the thing. What about the spaghetti? Oh, and chili! Okay. I mean, of course. I'm about to just put Hannah and then hit submit. And then whatever happens, happens. You know? Mrs. Olsen keeps calling. Call her back. Wait. Could it be? It could be, baby. It could be, baby. Okay, so do I unlock? Missing? Is this the same apartment, but like fucked up? Becca, you knew. Becca, the thing is that you knew. That's the thing that you've got to understand. You knew. Ma'am. Oh. This isn't the same hotel. This is just... Oh, 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 oh. It's just different scenarios of people that are missing, I guess. Um. Oh, 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 oh. Dog! No! Who the fuck? Why the fuck? Oh, oh, oh. Oh. What the fuck? What the fuck, dude? Okay. What am I trying to figure out? No. Who stole his money? When was Marley hospitalized? Did Jasmine move to another state? How many times did you physically assault someone in the house? <laughs> Between November 7th and November 15th. How many times did Philip physically assault someone in the house? Wait, I want to look at the different scenarios because there's a dog in this one who's dead and that really upsets me. The break in? The celebrations. Blood. Oh, this is just one. This is just one of them. There aren't options. Are we. Why did it take you. Why did it take you so long? What is going on with this? Load? Think? Think? 
think it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Um. Oh. Oh, this is too much. Also, the game, like, can't even look. Oh. Oh. Oh, it's not good in here. Things happened in this space that were not good. So that's something to keep in mind. Also, the game like, can't function. I'm going back to the puppy. Wait. I'll come back to this shit later. We'll go in order. There is a dog. I need to solve the crime. Okay. We're okay. Just lo load in. It's okay. Think about it. Think about it. Bird D. Cart convenience. One backpack. Thank you for your business. I don't think that's... Okay, we got it. We got... This is the house of someone who does the drugs. And by... And, like, you gotta keep that in mind. Um... They eat the suit. With a fork. Oh, they got the Blu-rays though. Honor and Duty Two. Oh, they're they're video games. Dragons of Haven. Oh my God, the video games. SOS Brigade. I just so happen to be in a house of people who do the drug. Oh, my God. Yep, really look at the knife. It's a knife. Like. Stephanie. Why Stephanie, Kello? Client meeting, client meeting, client meeting at the casino. Stephanie, Rosenmart. Okay, so is this like a pimp's house? Did we go, like, zero to sixty, like, the darkest shit you've ever imagined in your life? Like, did we go, like, oh, the kids... There's a, gu a guy and he gambles. That's pretty sad, to, like... Imagine the worst thing you've ever imagined in your whole life. The cr The creature? Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, Irene dinner. I don't like it here. For like a number of reasons. Can I cook noodle? That's the question, ain't it? Stick. Feather rock. Outdoor scavenger hunt. A feather, something shiny, a walnut, something with a hole, something spiky, something with stripes, an acorn, and a flower. Call me if you ever need anything. Is this a child's room? It is. Can I boil noodles specifically in the hours of nighttime? That's the question. And the answer is no. They won't let me. Emma, I don't know if I can do this any longer. I don't even want any jewelry or anything anymore. I'm sick of this. See myself in the mirror and I don't even know why I'm here. I just want to get out of here. You can't. Jesus, it's been only three months since she tried, and you saw what Philip was like. He's brutal. He went absolute nuts. Please, I'm begging you. I don't want to lose you, too. 
Marley, what should I do? My bag's gone. The client stole it. I don't have any of the money. I'm so scared. Do you think Philip would forgive me? He loves me, so he'll know it's not my fault, right? Did you try calling Rose? No. Tell her your situation. Will she help? She might tell Philip. You know she won't, Emma. You're right. I'll call her. Oh, God. Uh, heard you were feeling down recently, so I'm thinking we could do a special girls' night with everyone. What do you think? Good idea. Are we watching a movie? I'll be borrowing some from the library today, and we have some popcorn in the pantry. Fingers crossed they're not expired. That sounds like fun. Thank you. Great. 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 Good. Good. Everyone do the drug. That's something you gotta know. I have no reflection. Dear sister, I'm sorry I never said goodbye properly. Adios, but then she couldn't spell it. I now have a boyfriend and we're living together. Don't worry, everything's going well. I also have a lot of friends here with me in the room I share. They're all real nice and they're always trying to help. The only awkward thing is that my bed was someone else's for a bit, so they told me it's a little odd to see someone there. Like, it's a ghost! Ha! Huh? Did they die? How are you? How's everything going? Did you get that new tennis racket? I remember when we were kids, we would go to the park to practice. You were worse compared to me then, but now I can never beat you in a match. I'm so proud of having such a hardworking sister. I miss you. I wish I was there with you. Hey. Remove the bandage after 24 hours. Wash the tattoo carefully with soap and water. Patch to dry. Apply the ointment. For the next two weeks, wash dry. Then apply the ointment to keep the area of skin tattoo moist. If you have any questions, just let Philip know to call me. For my favorite girl. To my baby. I don't... Like it. I don't like... And, like, I don't know if this is the vibe. If these girls sound... Young. And there's a stuffed animal on the bed. And... I just don't know... You know? Emma. Oh, Rose. Flip this and write your name before 4 a.m. I'll give you a new pouch later. It feels pretty bad. What the fuck is that? Who's this boy that you're a fan of? Oh my god, go prone. What's under the bed? Literally nothing is under the bed. Can't go in there. I have no reflection. Stephanie. Okay. This went poorly. So, oh my god, he has like a fucking... He has a fucking... A fucking cane with this... I... Just hate... Chloroform? Okay. I mean, it's not surprising given that- what is this? Portable lock. Oh, it was on the door. Ask you, this is like a pimp's house. It's not good. Him play video game. Um. Could he be any more like cliche with the fucking decor? And like, come on, dude. Fucking. Fucking Philip. My God. Guide to successful homeschooling. I'm going to die. So. Sketchbook. Papa's two plant a necklace. 4 a.m. Philip picked us up. We arrived home. Philip counted. He slept. He woke up when I woke up to go to the restroom. He showered. Last to from falling. He came back to get his other phone. He was talking to Marley. He left for his house. Might have gone to see security footage. He came back to meet a dealer. Then he checked the contents. 10.40, he left. Metal ring to hold both sides. He left. He came back. We left with him. 
He can be unpredictable. Be more careful. He may notice them not asleep. Oops. Variation with the piece across the chest. Philip picked us up. 440 to 555. We arrived home. Philip counted. He beat up Stephanie. Yeah, I mean, let's just write that down. He checked our rooms. I was too exhausted and slept till 1 p.m. He wasn't in the house. Emma told me he was gone when she woke up around 12 p.m. He came back. He talked to me about a new rich client that his friend knows. He left to meet the client and friend. He came back. We left with him. He's always out for a long time and he meets with rich clients. Good opportunity. Philip picked us up 420 to blaze it to 450. We arrived home. Philip counted. He slept. He took Spike on a walk. He watched some TV. He left. Why did the dog have to die, though? This guy? Absolutely fucking annihilate him. But what, why did the dog have to die? He came back and took Marley out with him. Marley was not told about it. It seemed like they were meeting a client. He came back, but without Marley and with just her bag, he seemed upset. We left. Set up a client for a meet with Irene after three leaves. What happened to Marley? Philip picked us up. We arrived home. Philip counted. He was talking to someone about a party on the phone while everyone's sleeping. He left to his house, question mark. He came back really angry. Woke everyone up. He told me that a friend betrayed him. He took a pack of dope and left. He came back, sat on the couch, and just watched everyone, but still seemed angry. He had some dinner. Later, he was texting while we were getting ready. 8 p.m. we left. He's physically abusive when he's upset. Better choose a different day. Philip picked us up. We arrive home. Philip counted. He was talking on the phone. I slept until 1. He was not in the house at 1 p.m. That's going to be something that I have to go over probably 700 times when I'm actually trying to solve the problem. Marley. Hey, are you feeling down recently? We go with Special Girls Night with everyone. What do you think? Are we watching a movie? So this is Rose's phone. Thank you for taking care of Irene today. Can you give me a rundown of how she was today? So there's this guy that Irene plays with every time I take her to the park, and he seems like a nice guy. She plays with a stranger? How did that happen? It's kind of my fault. Remember about two weeks ago when I brought her to the park? For just a few seconds, I took my eyes off her, and she was gone. I called her on her cell, but she didn't pick up. I didn't call the cops because I knew it'd be trouble for us. So I desperately searched for her. Later, I found her sitting on a bench next to this stranger. Irene told me she hurt her leg while climbing a tree, and this stranger found her, bandaged her, and stayed with her until I found her. Since then, when we go to the park, she spends time with him. Please don't let her talk to strangers from now on. Also, I don't want her to go to that park anymore. Sorry for not telling you. I thought it was great since she didn't really have any friends. I'll take her to another park from now on. Please, Philip, honey, she's our daughter. She doesn't need to be part of this life. We're fine just as we are. Please stop this. She is mine, and she'll make money for me. What? What? We're going to party make plans. We'll be there. We don't want to go out for the usual night shift. We're going to be at the party the whole night. Night shift. Expenses. All the girls made money. Marley stopped making money because Marley died. Positive parenting. Okay. I don't think that your parenting was very positive. But that's just me. Um that's just my opinion. And what do I know? Okay, this is Stephanie's drink. Oh, purse. Today, a new- okay, this is Irene's diary. Today, a new girl came to live with us. Daddy named her Stephanie. She's closer to my age than anyone else. Maybe I can be friends with her. She really likes Spike, and Spike is never good to new people. She must be a really nice girl. How old are you, honey? How old are you? Today, I met a kind man at the park. When I hurt my leg, he helped me. He said he just came back from a trip a month ago and was visiting the cemetery next to the park. He seems sad. Mommy always tells me to not trust guys, but I don't think he's a bad guy. Maybe if I meet him again at the park, I can give him my snack so he can cheer up. Today, Marley was crying in her room. 
Marley always seems happy, but sometimes I hear her crying after the others leave. I want to ask her if she needs help, but I think she doesn't want anyone to know. Should I talk to mommy about it? Today I went to the park and he was there. I told him about the TV show last night. It was about the many species of plants and flowers, and that even now not all of them are discovered. I told him I want to be the one to discover them, but I'm not good at science. Then he said if I don't give up, I can do it. I'm happy I told him. I wonder if this is what friends are like. Today was a cleaning day. We found Janine's books that she left. I miss her. Sometimes when she went to work, she'd come back with candy for me. She told me that she would text me a thumbs up if she went back home. That was three months ago now. No one wants to tell me if she went somewhere else. The other girls just tell me to keep my, my lips zipped. I also found my old marble. I went to the park today and we found everything on the list. The scavenger hunt was super duper fun. Maybe we can collect different colors of rocks next time. Okay. 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 All right. So we got the fucking lunchbox. And then this is Irene's dinner. And then Okay. Um I've hated every moment of this. So, let's keep that in mind. All right, who stole Emma's money? I didn't even know that someone stole Emma's money. So this is news to me. This is news to me that someone stole Emma's Emma's money. Um Okay. So oh, I got turned around there. Okay. So I want to read the there was a big sheet is this Emma's phone? No. This is Stephanie. This is Stephanie's little desk. And then... If I read something and the door opens, the game is over. Oh, a security camera! Yeah! Of course! course feeling good about that all right today philip got stephanie a gift from goldstone it's already her second one since she came the last one i got was way back in september i know he's doing it just so she feels comfortable with us but i feel like he's giving way too much to her i know i'm immature to think this way he hates when people are immature i need to trust him and stop thinking about stupid things Last night, I think I saw my parents. They were across the street at a restaurant. They were smiling and laughing. They seemed happy. I wish I never see them again. Last night's client was the worst. He was nice the last time, so I was happy that he called for me again, but he was actually one of the psychopath clients. Burning me with a cigarette so many times he made me want to scream. I can cover it up with makeup for now, but I just hope other clients won't notice. Great. This morning, Stephanie was disciplined for the first time. She was 50 off her quota. She was terrified, but it needed to happen for her to learn to grow. Of all the things I have to do, I can never get used to watching a beating. I always wished I could be high at those times so I can go numb to what's going on. It reminds me of when I got beaten and I don't want to experience it ever again. Philip said I looked cute this morning. I should wear my slip dress more often. Maybe I can. It's not my fault she wanted it. Okay, Andrew and Kenneth and... You know, when you... You know... Do you ever have a dream that you wit, you, you want, you wit, you, you wanted, you wish, you... Oh, God. Remember when they were cellmates? We were having, like, such a good time, dude. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, I don't want to do this anymore. Oh, I don't want to do this anymore. Oh, God. Oh, God. Marley gets discharged. Okay, Marley was in the... Oh. <laughs> Alex. 
no. Remember when I was like, I love to solve crime and I have such a fun and good time when I solve crime. Do you remember that? Where is literally any information about Emma having her money stolen? Okay, no, wait. She texted. My bag's gone. The client stole it. I don't have any of the money. I'm so scared. Okay, who stole her money? So that was the 11 11 2018. So. 11 11. So she was meeting. What the, what? Why is Rose in all case? It wasn't Rose, though. Who the fuck? This is, that's the thing. There are fun, there are fun crimes to solve, you know? That where, like, you don't see the blood of a dog. You know? Did she write in her diary that day? It's not my fault. She wanted it. What does this mean? Did she overdose one of the others? Marley? Presumably? Okay, wait, where's the... Okay, okay, but what is the date? 11-9. Can we get... We get an eleven eleven up in here. Can we do that for me? Eleven ten for me and for my family and my friends and the things that we enjoy. No, eleven eleven is not here. Okay. Why is this in this bed, too? Well, who? So I'm assuming that she was plotting to kill him. Whoever's book this is, which is... Someone's. Um, wait, we had 1112, though. So what happened? Philip picked this up. We arrived home. He counted. Philip slept. Big Spike gonna walk. Okay, it doesn't mention... He came back and took Marley out. On the 12th. What happened to Marley? 11... 11, night shift. Emma. 500. Okay, but how do I... Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Okay, and then she called Rose, who didn't fucking do anything, presumably. Now, these are your two clients. She did, she, get, she did that text at 8 a.m., though. I mean, 2 a.m. It was 2 a.m. So was it Andrew? Like, these are dates, but, like... What about Rose's phone, too? Whoa, we're running. At 2.30 a.m. Um.
Wait. Mm. Why is this happening? November 14th. That's not the 11th, is the thing. Who the fuck? Who was phone? Like, who was hand hook car door hook? Hand car door. Right? Like. Call me if you ever need anything. 764. Okay, who is that? Who who said that? Who said that to her? This is the same picture that was in the apartment last time. Is one of the girls Hazel? Or... This is Rose's phone. What the fuck? It's the same photo, so it's like... And this was part of the same, like, incident thing? And I just thought that they were, like, unrelated and, like, about missing people, but, like... No. They're related. But in what- but who- in what way? I was trying to look at phone numbers and I- the girls don't go by their real names. That's the thing. But Rose has this specifically. And Rose... How did I even do that? How did I even, like... I have to flip it over. Okay. Is it, is it the mom? Like what, what is the context for you having this? The kid has a phone, okay. I was looking for phone numbers. Is there phone numbers anywhere? No, these people do not have phone numbers. Um. I missed it. Mommy is going to die. Okay, a lot of calls to this person. So whoever this person is, is the person that came in with the fucking knife. Right? It's... Is this the stranger from the park? Was he, did he just fucking sh was he like call me if you need help i will fucking kill everyone in your household <laughs> i will commit so many crimes you have no idea what i'm capable of volvamore one of the worst one of the worst usernames ever to be on twitch.tv so Think about that. 
Irene Haynes. Was that the surname of the family before? You're welcome. But it, it, I say you're welcome, but it's cost me everything, so. We got the rock and the stick and the thing and the, and the thing and the, and the dog. Okay, I haven't answered one question. Not even one. When was Marley hospitalized? Who's the intruder? Who's so... Oh my god, I can go back to look at the... Why? Why can I go back to look at this? We're in Miami, Florida right now. That's not even close to where any of this is. And if the... I... I'm like having a mental breakdown. This... What the fuck? Why do they do this to me? Why are they doing this to me specifically? Is the question that I have. The thing is, okay. It, was she from Miami? Did, why would she? Why this? You know? I'm so, like, this one is fucking with me so bad. This is fucking with me so bad. Client meeting at RR Hotel. Rose. But that's not... I'm so... Who stole Emma's money? I did, as far as we're concerned. She's gonna go back to my... Oh my god. It all comes together. With the drug. And the... Uh... Okay. Okay. All right, I'm very calm. The fact that this door is inaccessible stresses me out. I'm very calm. I'm in the room. Um, dear sister. Okay, so this is some. This is Stephanie, who has a sister. The bed was someone else's, but they left. So I'm assuming this was Janine's bed. You because Janine is is no good. I'm talking to you, my old friend Sunday, not on the eleventh, wear your best dress. An old friend. But this is Stephanie's desk, right? This is Emma's. Where the fuck was Emma? <laughs> like Emma, come home. Like, unclear, dude. Like, I've never been less clear. When was Marley hospitalized? Let's find out. Um, sketchbook. came back without Marley, so. 11, 12, I'm assuming. And then, does that line up? Yeah, because then she got discharged from the hospital. 11, 12, what is the year? No, I no. Twenty eighteen, baby. Oh, this is. 
years later. Oh no. The safe has the money. Oh, phone. Oh, phone. Oh, two of them. Mr. Hunt. Same time, same place, and as usual on this coming Thursday, I want the same girl. Hey, what's the deal? Why is her face bruised? I'm not paying for damaged goods. Do you want a refund? I want to get what I pay for. Horrible. Anderson's place got hit last night. Word on the street is that it was Harry. Whatever you do, don't cross into his territory. I already talked it out with him. As long as he stays in his area, I stay with mine. Hey, you got some girls. When do you want him? Two at the casino. Great. I hate you. Hey, partner. She's ready. When do you have a slot open for? She can come on Saturday at 9 a.m. Black rose and the thigh as usual. That's what they need to work. Are you sure about this? She's a bit young, you know. When the guy... When the guy... Buying... Your services from a pimp is like, Are you sure about this? She's a bit young. That's when you know that it's very bad. That's when you know that it's like extremely bad. Hey doc, how's Marley? Much better than yesterday. Her breathing's stable now, but her body really is in awful shape. Overdosing is one thing, but she can really be in trouble if she keeps going like this. Oh, this is the tattoo artist. Yeah. Oh, yes, yeah, the tattoo artist. Great. With Anton. With Anton. I'm so happy to be here with Anton. <laughs> Nothing good's going on. I can assure you of that. Okay, I was... Okay. It is 2018. And who has an appointment with the tattoo artist? Stop on the 17th. And it was Stephanie, I'm pretty sure. Is that what this was? No. Oh yeah, on Saturday. Which was, I'm assuming, the 17th. Yeah. Stephanie. Because she's, you know, she's young and new. How many times does Philip physically assault someone in the house? <laughs> like, it's not funny, but like, what the fuck? What the fuck, dude? Warrior cats! Okay. Um... Wait, there's a fridge. I, he I will try to open the door as many times as it takes. Okay, so then we had... Where's the account of her meeting the stranger in the park? Visiting the cemetery? He seems sad. This is what friends are like. We found Janine's books that she left. When it was when she went to work, she'd come back with candy for me. Show me that she would text me a thumbs up if she went back home. That was three months ago. I don't think she went home. I'll go back to the safe, of course. I will, I will run to the safe at speeds that you can't even begin to imagine. Oh... Boot. No, 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 no. Is this... Is this irrelevant? Is something in boot? Is boot footprint what we need? Knife is not relevant. But boot? My god, is it ever relevant. Footprint? Oh, footprint tread. Okay. Blood. Blood, no feet. 
Oh, wait. I missed this. Westwood Apartments. Westwood Apartments. I don't see any feet. Where is Westwood Apartments? Why is that relevant to me? Wear him foot. Why me look at foot? You know? Okay, yeah, I need to be more thorough. I missed him foot. We got the lock that they busted open. It not foot. The thing is, the blood trail is, like, really strange. Like... Like, it started in this room. You know? And then they just, like, stabbed the dog on their way out. Oh. Oh, he was beating mommy to death. He was beating mommy to death. Um... And then someone kicked the door in from the outside. Those are two unrelated incidents, I think. Whoever was in this room. Because Rose was getting beat up and then he came inside and he was like, fuck, dude. And he went fucking crazy, baby, from Westwood Apartments. And then someone... What is this? Is that an old thing, or is that relevant to this case, that someone hit the wall really hard? There's also blood on the counter. Like, what is the order of events here? Like, was he fighting the dog? <laughs> Okay. I would like answers, actually. Like, I know that it's my job to find them, but I would just, like, like to... I would just want to know what happened. Like, now I'm just curious. Like, what the fuck it occurred in the household? With the basketball and the... Let me call him. Okay, so she frantically phoned him at about this time, and then he called her back at 8 o'clock. And was like, what the fuck? Okay. What am I solving again? How many times did Philip physically assault someone in the house between the 7th and the 15th? Let's find out. Can I press C real quick? The fuck? What does this do? What am I scanning for? Oh, to scan. We can take photos. I don't want to take photos. This is horrible. Something terrible happened. I'm not, you know? Oh, some flowers from Irene. She says she hopes you feel better. I put an extra bag of ice in the freezer. I told Marley to give it to you when you need a new one. Call me if you need anything. Yikes.
But we can fix things later because scenarios are connected. Understood. Okay, so. How many times did he beat someone to death? Perhaps 17? We're wrong about the tattoo. Was it Irene? Oh. Why... Why was the E capitalized in that? Oh. Oh no. Irene Haynes, oh full name, that's true. Nope. Okay. Great. No, I feel really good about that one, I think. Who got beat? He was talking to Marley. He felt really good about it. He showered. It was good. He was good. Okay, Becca, coming in with the guide. Coming in with the guide for the for the puzzle game, so I don't have to keep looking through the books of people who've been beaten to death. Um, hello. Hi. Can we? Why is it not typing anything? Oh, it wants a number. Okay. The game wants you to fail, part guy. Papa. <laughs> well, that's pretty cruel, I think. That's pretty fucked up, I think. Frank stole Emma's money? Okay, who is Frank? I like I have the answers, but I do want to understand so that I can solve things by my on my own in the future. So who is Frank to her? Does she write Frank down? No. Frank is just in here. Another girl over. I would not have figured that out because I'm very stupid. Here we go! Oh no. It's fine. Don't worry about it. It's fine. Here we go, everybody. More. Here we go. Here it is. My favorite fun experience that I have. Oh. Boot. Him boot. Him boot. It was- that's what it was for. Him boot. Oh, Becca, thank you for the fortifying sip. The music's very somber. Yeah. No, the flower. Okay, nothing to like perceive. April 2015. Oh, this is. Oh, no. So this is before. Girl found after being missing for 28 years. Isabel Newton. Thomas Harrington. Tomas? Rose McLaughlin, the managing agent, shall collect Ross McLaughlin, according to Leach, which conforms 
the housing procedures and abides by and follows Florida real estate law. Rent is due on or before the first of each month. Of each month, five hundred dollars for the thing. Tomas. What the fuck was Thomas doing? What? Did like, we were like, oh, social security took the kids. I don't think that it was good. I don't think that, I don't think that that was good that they did that. Like, we were like, oh, it's okay. But, like, I was like, that's an ominous message, even though it was... I don't think she was CPS. I think that she kidnapped them. Oh, my God. Oh, from the treasure hunt. Tomas! Have you seen this person? Not Hazel. Not Hazel. Not Hazel. Okay. Why specifically Hazel? Is Nicholas okay? Like... The evening of November 16th, Thomas Harrington returned home from work to find his 34-year-old fiance Catherine Patton, hanging from the ceiling of the living room fan. A couple months prior to the incident, Child Protective Services took her... took and relocated her children after an investigation of an alleg allegation Mr. Harrington was unavailable for comment. I heard you were leaving Nashville. This is a gift for you. Hope this can help you in the new life ahead of you, Todd. Hey, Thomas. I'm running for you. I know you can barely afford a motel. Living in your car is not healthy. I want you to take care of yourself. If it becomes really difficult, you can always come back here to the Nashville church. We love your company, and you can stay at my place until you make some money. Oops. No, I didn't want to exit out. Happy birthday, Tomas! I wish you all the best for the coming year. Thank you for being such a great friend. I enjoy all of our conversations. and we can meet more, so call me anytime you want to talk. Thanks, Todd. Happy holidays. How are you doing, Tomas? I'm so happy that you stayed strong this year as well. During summer next year, I'm planning to visit you. I'll text you when I have a clear date, so you can let me know where you're staying then. She said yes. But at what cost? Thought that was a phone? It's not. This is just, like, pretty fucked up. That's a phone. Todd, Todd, Todd. Okay, so this is for, when, for Irene. And then... Calling out, and then he called Todd. Hi. Thank you for what you did. I don't know what else to say, but that you saved us. <laughs> we can't thank you enough. It's okay. Hey, Thomas. Are you back at that place again? I can uh, never reach you during November. Uh, please, I'm worried about you. I just want to know how you're doing. Uh, call me when you get this. Oh, Tomas. Missing. Hazel Woods. Hazel was last seen on December 12th, 2004. Oh, she was kidnapped from foster care. That's why Nic he's not looking for Nicholas.
Wearing a pink striped sweater and blue jeans, she was reported missing from Jane's foster care between 6.30 p.m. and 9.30 p.m. The caretakers believe she'd run away. Okay, so is Rose Hazel? And then the child is Greg. Okay, Josh, Nicholas Woods, Salt Lake City. I can't click on any of these. Oh. Seen with a baby in a blue stroller. Seen with blue plaid dress, sleeping on bench, purple hair jean jacket. Gray and pink hoodie. Seen with a man in wheelchair, red hair. So Hazel, I don't, was Hazel the girl turning? So I'm very, um, stupid. So, something to keep in mind. Okay. Uh... Okay, that's it. That's the whole apartment. Who entered through the window? What? The boots are coming in the door. Who entered through the window? That's what this is. The fuck? Okay. Why is your jacket like dipped in blood? Oh, there's his old wallet from our boy. Oh. I didn't even notice. I was just like stool. He likes to sit. I just didn't I didn't because there's no body. Was the body removed? Was this a... Was the body... Because there's no bodies in this. Was this... Did he do it and the body was removed? Or did he not do it? And the body... He's... There's no body because he... Was saved. Or left. Oh, rope bundle, cigarette pack, and beer single. Of course. I hate it. Okay. Who came in the window? Why is this relevant? To know that it's raining? November 16th, 2018. Okay, so this is... This calendar is off. Why is the calendar off? Why, why this? It, what... Blood... Boot... What the fuck occurred? Like... What occurred? Open up! Like, Philip occurred. Philip was in the house. Someone came through the window, and also Thomas was trying to hang himself and may or may not have done that so but this but this is also this is thomas's photo so he was here or was he the thing about this is that the boots do not exit the home so did philip die the boots enter the home and they get into a little bit of a scuffle, but then the boots do not exit the home. Did like, 
Did Rose crawl through the window? Why would Rose go through the window? Why? What if they saved him from hanging himself and then he immediately was killed in the next room? Can you imagine? Oh, there's Nicholas. Is Nick did Nicholas marry a is he married? To a boy? Is that who Josh is? He has a husband? That's his dad. Josh, god damn it. What's the point then? What's the point of anything? You think I remember the name of Josh paying child support? So disappointing. So awful. Okay, and then this was Todd who's been giving him the messages and being like, love you, dude, my favorite friend. And then... Todd called a lot. Did he... The 16th at 9.56, on the 16th at 9.56. Did, did Todd crawl through the window? Did Todd panic and come around and crawl through the window? And try to get him down? Then what the fuck is this? Every day of my life, I'm just like, okay, so the- you said that the weather might be related to the fact that his wet footprints came in, so... 10 a.m. On the 16th. 10 a.m. to 12 p.m. On the 16th. When was this phone call made? Wait, this was the 15th. Okay, yeah, and then... 9.56 a.m. So... He didn't get to do it. He was cooking up. He was making, putting the trash. He had the oven and the oil ready to make cane sugar. And then, oh fuck, he came in the house. You know? Also, why is there a first aid kit out? Is the first- it was the first aid kit to, well, okay, cause he got- cause he got fucked up in the fight. That's why- cause there's blood on his jacket, cause he did stab a dog. And got stabbed in the arm. Cause there's a hole in the arm. So he got stabbed in the arm, patching himself up, being a good boy, but then was like, I'm also going to kill myself. I'm gonna fix this wound on my arm, but then, but then, and then someone got a little push and they got bonked with something or shot or just kind of pushed over, I'm unclear. The blood is, why is this here? What is this little blood splatter? Anyway, if we had the twin clock snapping power, this would all be over. Everything in my life would be incredible.
If only I had the twin clock snapping power. Okay, I'm gonna probably get all of this wrong. Well, first of all, who is the intruder? Tomas. What? No, why does it keep capitalizing like some letters? What is your last name, Tomas? Harrington? Understood. No, great. Yeah, no, I didn't, I didn't answer that. I just wanted to fill that out. I just wanted to fill that out. That's not, that's not what I wanted. Take me back here. Thank you so much for loading me. It's 1028 AM right now. That's what it just said. It's 1028 right now. The thing is, no, the stool is still upright. Is that what it's implying? That because the stool isn't kicked over that like- But who the fuck came through the window? What is happening? In this fucking- Who died? Unclear. Who's the killer? Unclear, actually. I'm assuming that- I'm assuming that Todd came over. It's dark because it's raining. It's a stormy day. Todd's a good friend. And... I like him very much, so... Does he have a last name? Is it just Todd? So the- okay. So if it was... 9.30... Did this stop him from trying to kill himself? I don't know what answer we have wrong. Oh, I didn't put who stole Emma's money. Maybe Irene moved to another state also. I, I guess, okay. Who entered through the window, who died and who's the killer? I feel like it's so obvious to be like, Thomas, to, like, I'm gonna put Todd. I don't know. Who died? Todd. <laughs> Did Philip die? Or is it just the, the easy answer that it was that Thomas... Thomas died and Philip did it. And that's the end of it. No, it wasn't. It wasn't. But which one was wrong? But which one was wrong, though? I have to end the stream, but which one was wrong, though? Which one was right and which one was wrong? Alright, let's do this. Process of elimination. Who died? Okay, he died. Thomas is dead. Thomas is dead. 
but I don't know Philip's last name. I don't remember Philip's last name, if he has a last name. I'm assuming he wouldn't just have it because he's a pimp. He's just Philip. Like, was it the landlord? Ross McLaughlin. Oh, he had until the 16th today to pay his rent. And he wasn't going to. There's just like so much happening all at once. Do I have to go to do I have to go to the second scenario to try and find Philip's name? I don't know how I would even do that. You know what? It's fine. We're going to go to the Oh, he did get shot. Okay. Head hurty. Um... We will return. No, not this. Quit the exam. Go to the fourth floor so I can look at it. Uh oh I'm in the elevator. There's an apartment. Can I go in the other apartments? No. I can be in the hallway. And that's something you gotta know. And the game can lag because I'm sprinting at full speed. Okay. Got a nice little... Someone eating a snickers but doing a really bad job we got the little creatures we got more creatures okay it's 2004 i don't know if all the cases are related is the thing who lives here brenda there's birthday hazel's disappearance oh god is it all related? Greta Sherman. Oh! Pretty fucked. What the fuck were you standing in? Ooh, feet. Scouters needed. Baby monitor here. Where second baby monitor? Oh, oh. Enter the number? Oh my god.
It might be unrelated, but still. This is going to be related to the next one. I think that this is going to be a series of cases in, like, one apartment building, which is going to be fun. So, I'm not going to look at these too hard because I am going to stop playing right now. And I don't want to forget because I- and I will. Okay, the other big monitor is here. So... Someone watching TV could hear the murder uh, take place. So think about that. I have never felt, um, stupider in my life, so... Hope we're all feeling good. I have never felt that I am so incapable of thought in my life. Um, tomorrow we're doing a Halloween special, uh, just, I don't know, doing something. Uh, and then we'll come back to this and my head will hurt even more. And you won't believe how much my head hurts. So, incredible. <laughs> I love you guys. Thank you for coming. Happy Halloween. Goodbye.